What's up, people? This your boy Mercury Ra, and this is the Mercury Says Show. This show, we'll be talking about ego. Ego is, how could I say? Ego is our worst enemy. Ego creates your enemies, and ego lies with inside of us. It's an old saying they say, uh, your friends are close, but your enemies are closer. And when they say that, they're talking about your ego, because your ego is you. Your ego is inside of you. That's the fight and battle that a lot of people deal with, <clears throat> that fight with inside. When you hear voices in your head and, and things like that, something telling you, you know, do some things and then you question it, that's ego. Ego creates enemies. When you look at a person, that's your enemy. That's your ego. That's the perception of your ego. Life is, is, is tricky, but ego is the biggest trickster. Ego helps things become impossible. <clears throat> or helps things that could you know, jam you up become reality. Ego created the devil. In some religions, they will tell you that that ego manifested the devil. And this is true. Your ego is your own worst enemy. Your ego is your own worst enemy. If you could somehow stop protecting your ego, because people lie, cheat, steal, and kill in the name of their ego. We got to figure out how to stop protecting the ego and just let the ego go. Like, if we could figure that out, we'd be okay. But like I said, ego is, man, it's crazy because I was just watching a couple things on it. That's why, you know, I'm talking about it right now. And it, it's like pretty mind boggling, if you know what I mean. Like, it's like, wow, it made me look at the ego as a, basically a separate entity from who you are. You know what I mean? It's like, damn. People, I'm a Gemini. People say, oh, you got split personalities. Split personalities. But what does that mean when you have an ego living inside of you? If you're not a Gemini. You know what I mean? So it's like, don't you have a split personality as well? <laughs> I mean, come on, man. You know what I mean? Ego. 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 Lego. Ego. Whatever. Ego. We got to be more mindful of our ego, people. Because... An ego is a disease, man. Until you're able to humble yourself from the ignorance, you know, from the subliminal messages, you know, they sending at you, you know, negative things, you know, trying to empower yourself for the positive or the better, that ego will get right in your way. I mean, it's times when, it's times when I know I'm coming to something real good or something real Big, something that's going to work for me and everybody else. Something always getting in the way. Something getting in the way. They say that you don't get to what's, you know, you don't get to your goals unless you hit bumps in the road or things of that nature. Yeah, well, now I know who's the bumps in the ro who causes the bumps in the road. It's your ego. It's you. It's your inner self. You have to know who it is. Who it is before you could conquer it. You know what I mean? I said, I used to be a hothead. I used to argue with everybody. Not no more. This shit ain't worth it, man. People argue every day. I mean, I get in a little arguments with, you know, people that's close to me, but that's that's more emotional than anything. You, you know? That's when you're dealing with emotion. But outside of that, you're arguing with somebody that's, you know, might be just a friend or, you know, you know whatever else, a teammate or a co-worker. It's... It's more dealing with the ego because now you put yourself as, you know, in a place where you're being challenged. You know what I mean? And, and now ego getting away. Now you got to fight, scrape, and pull teeth to, to show that other person where you stand at. You know what I mean? So it's ego. Leave that ego shit alone, man. That ego is it's crazy. Bananas. It's like fucking Madagascar at night. You know what I mean? So, you know, try to leave that ego alone and, and get on with, with the world. In life, because we got bigger, uh, I ain't going to say fish, 
Is a whale a fish? But we got bigger whales to fry. You know what I mean? So, let's just try to get get it together, man. Think about it. Be mindful of who your ego is. Because now, the more mindful you are of your ego, it's going to challenge you even more. Until, until he or she or whatever your ego is get weak and just give up. That's the way you conquer your ego. By challenging it. Because, you know, deep inside, your ego is strong when you don't know who the enemy is. You know what I mean? Once you, once you know who your enemy is, then you can find them, then you can move around them, or then you can defeat them. You know what I'm saying? Because the devil's biggest secret was not letting you know who he or she was. You know what I mean? Now we know who it is. It's the ego. Your perception on life. You know, things you, when you're doing something, you try to stop it, but you can't. It's your ego. You know what I mean? So, once again, it's your boy Mercury Ra. This is the Mercury Says Show. Um, I'm going to have another episode on something else right after this, but I just wanted to, you know, throw that ego joint at you because I, that shit is prime time. That's the cause of everything. And um, unless you're a robot, you got an ego. Remember that. Beyonce said it, you know what I mean, Beyonce even said it, and Kanye, you know what I mean, so be mindful of that, listen to that song again, I just listen to it again, that shit crazy, it's deeper than what, just partying and dancing, you know, so, um, it's Mercury Ra, I love y'all, far near and dear, even if I don't know you that well, I love you as as a human being, if you are human, and, um, love, peace, and happiness, love, peace, and, and happiness, Love, peace to all races, creeds, and cons, and beings, beings from on the planet Earth, the inner Earth, and, and, and galaxies far, far away. Until then, hotel.